This is the free motion quilting tutorial for Munch Munch Munch. This design is stitched by first stitching a triangle shape, then travel stitching a bit, and swirling around that triangle with a half circle. Here you can see it's I'm kind of squeezing one into that little area, so it's kind of small, but here's another one. You can see it a little bit better. Just a triangle shape and stitch around that with a half circle. And you may be wondering why I named it Munch Munch Munch, and the reason is this reminds me a lot of the way Pac-Man looks. Uh, this little um, video game character that liked to eat uh, all kinds of things. He was supposed to eat these little dots and mazes, and that's what it reminded me of, so I decided to name it Munch 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 after him. Now this design is going to work really good on pretty much any scale. All you have to do is simply expand the triangles, expand that half circle, and this is going to look great on a bed quilt. Definitely put it on a kid's quilt. I think it's got a fun texture that a kid would really appreciate and enjoy. And of course you could always tell them that it's Pac-Man, and of course they would love that as well. Now this is an echoing design, so if you wanted to expand it and then if you wanted to kind of play with it, change the texture up a bit, all you have to do is simply add more echoes, uh, more half circles around that last half circle shape. So in that situation I would simply travel stitch and echo around that circle where you see in the video right there. But really if you want to maintain the look of Pac-Man uh, and the munch 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 creature you're going to have to just keep it as a triangle and just one single swirl of half circle shape that will keep it looking that way. So bearing all that in mind here's what it looks like whenever you finish munch munch munch. Are you interested in learning more about free motion quilting? Make sure to check out the Free Motion Quilting Project and find over 300 video tutorials just like this one. Check it out at freemotionproject.com.